And welcome back. This is Kotel. Uh, we had some technical difficulties with the sound, uh, so unfortunately we were not able to get the first server. Um, I mean, the first map, which was a um, schoolhouse ridge. So they have now moved on to the second map under another server, which hopefully will resolve those issues and let them get at least one game in tonight for what this is, which is the Southern Aggression. TS the Southern Aggression is the TSA. Uh, current server pop is 220. It is a Boulevard Heights camp. 109 on the attacking CSA. 111 on the defending Union. Let's take a look at these two teams. Starting out with the defending Let's Union, we party. have 8th Georgia Monday under Colonel Darth and, and Colonel Knights. Back. We've got uh, yeah, the 42nd PA uh, under Hood and on Kilroy. Line, We've got the MWB led by Captain Willie Stone. Yeah, We've got Guys, the PB, Pickett's Brigade, oh, under Colonel Bocephus. We've got 19th Indiana under Captain Joker. Let's see, we've got, who else yes. is in here? Fourth West Virginia under, where is Lightburn? Lightburn, where's Lightburn? Yeah, I guess we can play flag guard. He's around here somewhere. Lightburn's in here somewhere. Then let's see, we've got Mr. Mattis and his guys on the guns. In fact, there's probably Lightburn out here. No, it's Mr. Chief. What are you doing out here, Mr. Chief? Alright, for the CSA, I'll start out with their arty and then work my way up. Let's see, they've got HL on at least one cannon. He might have some guys up here to take other cannons. In fact, here comes Snapperkins. I think that's what his plan is. We've got on the CSA team, Pilot leading the NYB. Oh, Yankee Pussy, holy shit. leading the HL. Rick Sled by 79th. NYH. We've got Slippin' Jimmy leading the Missouri State Guard. We've got 7 Tennessee under Captain Carson, 1st VA led by 1st Sergeant Johnson, the 8th Alabama led by my name Ryder, 1st VA, and the Western Sharpshooters. That is it, and the infantry is live. We will see. Uh, you, the, see the cannon still got to wait a minute, but uh, let's see where the Union wants to set up their defense and where the CSA is going to wait their attack. So the CSA is taking the expected route up the hill. We'll zoom out a little bit here so you guys can kind of see the angle. The CSA is approaching up this hill here. Let's see, the Union is splitting, looks like, into two elements. One on the left side of the uh, main tents and another on the right. On the right side here, we've got PB and 19th Indiana. And it looks like the rest is going to be on this left side here. Hey, what? Move it up. I don't know what Chief's doing. It looks like the uh, this main element here is not going to go all the way forward. They're going to kind of defend in this position. Um, these guys are going to defend here, which I think will be all right, as so long as they don't hang out too long or they get hit with too much power here. Um, the CSA is moving up in the woods so far in a concentrated mass. We'll see if they split off here or if they do a combined attack at some location. Now, uh, for those curious, this game is War of Rights. It's available on Steam for 30 U.S. dollars. Um, there's a link in the description to the website if you are interested in purchasing it. This event is the Southern Aggression. It is played every Friday at 8 p.m. EST. Uh, there is a link in the description to that Discord that's organized. The organizer is Captain, uh, Captain Colonel Knight from the 8th Georgia. Hit him up if you would be interested in getting your unit into the event. Right, find a position. I believe positions are still open, so... If you're a new person or a veteran looking for a unit, northeast, northeast. like maybe Captain Joker's here, the 19th Indiana, they're a good unit. But any of these units, um, there's links to, to their discords uh, in the description. If you see a unit that looks like fun, go ahead and join them. And of course, if you like these videos and like to see more, um, always appreciate uh, any likes, subscribes, comments, shares that you guys can do to help me grow the channel. So the Union did end up guarding pretty far forward here. And here comes 8th Alabama. Oh, wait a second. We got another charge here by the NYB into this side. And it looks like he's doing a bit of a distraction. So far, it looks like 8th Alabama here is flooding through. Along with HL. Now they are getting up and around the 42nd here. And 42nd is pulling back. 
Yeah, Joker moved his men forward here and wiped out one flag. There is an opportunity here. Beautiful job, PB. Eighth Georgia has taken him out. They can sandwich that last unit, but they've got to act before they get their respawns in. And okay, they've opted not to. Are they up to or not? They got to kind of shoot off the pot right now. Left wheel. Left wheel. Knight is going to turn his men. The problem is. You can't let these units metastasize. They get their manpower back too quick. Hold here. Our lines are fucking good. So now we see the attack here by Ace Georgia. But some of them are heading out towards. They let this flag get away, which is unfortunate. And we have another potential attack here by the first VA. Some. They kind of got separated here. Some got chasing off that little flag. And some were still here, but 8th Alabama turned on him. Was able to hit him pretty hard. And now you got the AB over here. While the rest of the Union is kind of centered over there. And then you've got 19th Indiana and PB that are not really engaged right now. Minus some minor shots by the WS. Um, I think the Union had an opportunity, but I think it has dwindled now at this point. And you can see the first VA is going to close the trap on what's left of this element out here. That's the 8th Georgia, and that will close that opportunity. At this point, 19th Indiana needs to get out of there, but Joker instead is moving forward. He's going to try to get a volley off. And he is going to fall back. Along with PB. I would still say they are very vulnerable now from this position. And it's gonna, they're going to have a very hard time of punching through. Although this line here with the 42nd along with other elements has stabilized. The danger is they've lost at least one of their flags here. That's going to make respawn rate very difficult. And is he still building the fort? I fucking love her. Can I just say I love this gun? See you say already coming in. Didn't do too much damage, but still let him know you're there. Still got the 19th Indiana and PB over here, but they are isolated now. And now you got the NYV back in. We've got a redeployment here by 8th Alabama and AB. Oh my god. Yeah, close your you can see the overall position has been a bit of a breach here by the CSA, but they weren't able to push all the way in. And you've got some security here for the Union side here, but um, honestly, I don't think these engagements are worth it. You're not actually impacting the force at rate at all, and all you're doing is bleeding tickets that you can't really afford to lose. And the NYV is now going to try to flank around, but uh, beat uh, Bocephus and... Joker are wisely pulling back now before the uh, news closes on them. On to the left, on to the left. Independent fire. Pour it in. It's one of those. And they're gone. They got a couple uh, for their trouble on the way out. But now we see that the uh, CSA has secured this frontal position here. Uh, 36 minutes remaining. Union doing a decent job in keeping pace of tickets. But unfortunately, they need to uh, do more than just keep pace. They need to oh, outpace the CSA. Three assassinations. They're all on an island, they right? The bottom. Yeah, we've got Captain Ricks trying to do a little bit of raid here. I don't, I don't know really what the value of this is, to be honest with you. you know, that's five tickets right there. Why, you know, okay, you killed him, yay. Yeah, he probably got on one skirmishing, so that's not bad. But Then we got forward movement here by, who is this, the NYV, in, the mouth. in a Good, decent dead, position here. Look what you've done. You've caused them. Kind of keeping them bottled up here. And, in fact, they're going to be joined by several other units by the CSA. And they are getting in some decent shots now. This element here is not really going to be able to stand up to that fire. And they're going to really continue to attrit so long as they're engaging against that many elements here. But on this side here, Take your shots and the Union is back. moving forward here Get against HL. Shoot him, shoot him. And there is, are they, is that all that's over here? That is all that's over here. The Union has an opportunity, I would say, to sweep around these guys if they attack in force. 
and knock them down and get their flag back up and possibly sweep around and isolate those units. But um, we'll see if they take that opportunity or not. They may just want to try to hold out as long as they can. But you see the CSA is continuing to rotate around. Here's AB getting a nice little skirmish line here, getting in even more of an angle, squeezing them in more and more. A four would be pretty for a second, if you can hear me, once you've taken your shot, pull back to the lieutenant. Yeah, now that window's closed, you've seen the CSA has moved back over to this side, so that option is now gone. And I don't know why that guy was going through there. Somebody's happy they got him. Here comes the 8th Georgia in a very nice looking line here. Georgia, right face, up and over. Let's go at the sprint, right boys. Right face, up and over. Find yourself, yeah. find your spot. Let's go, right let's go. So apparently the fucking right wing was collapsed. God damn it. God damn it. I, we're all right, we're going to have to hold this shit right here. Georgia, reform right here. Reform on the race. And to be honest with you, though, um, this is a pretty good juke here. You've got just skirmish moments out here. You know, well, not all skirmish. you got, you know, you got the NYV, the AB, the MSG. And they have drawn off a good chunk of the Union firepower. This is a great uh, distraction here by the CSA. While the bulk of their forces here are, at, are what I would classify as the decisive point on this side over here. And they might be able to punch through. We'll see. We still got Georgia and the WV here to try to stop them. It's not easy to punch through those two units, even with that much force. We'll see. Big right there. It's good. Nice oh. little volley there by the 8th Georgia. Don't you Make sure there's space for the Iguana! 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 Uh, except for, except for Ryder, we don't need that. Uh, maybe over there by that cannon get behind it. You might stay alive a better, man. Really mad dog. CSA is starting to get ahead on the ticket counter. As you can see, 32 minutes remaining. They are doing great on the time. And I very much approve of this skirmish line here that you see with the WS and the first VA. Spreading their fire out so the Union can't get any good shots on them. Can't get the mass fire. And as they peek out, so the nice thing about this is the Union can only really peek out, you know, in these set sectors. And they've got all this to shoot at. While that, you know, only has a few targets to shoot at. So it's much hey, better for them. Um, although I like this move by PB, by Bocephus. You see how he set himself up here, using the concealment of the tents and some spacing here to try to get some uh, more firepower down. Now we do. Uh, AB moved very deep in here, and Joker made them made him pay for that. Um, now if Joker, I would say, if Joker wants to, if he wants to be mobile like that, you know, try to swing out over here and maybe try to ambush the NYV and take some pressure off of that top unit. If he wants to be all mobile like that, I think he can do it. Kind of do what NYV likes to do, to be honest with you. NY NYV loves to do those kinds of moves. Koran's a 51st New York. Can we call him? He's a New York regiment. Can we call you NYV, Koran? Are you okay with that? Absolutely. Company's loaded, sir. Check. Company ceasefire. Load no. And at 31 minutes, the Union ready. has gone to engage. This battle is going very well right now for the CSA. And the CSA has now gone to engaged as well. It sounds like there was a cannon shot from Mattis and his boys that I missed, unfortunately. See uh, Etheridge uh, getting their cannon ready. I should say boys and girls. Actually, he does have uh, both in his uh, battery, so I should be, uh, shouldn't just say boys. Above the head a little bit. I think right now HO and uh, CSA is happy to exchange gunfire like this. They're, it's at a sufficient rate that um, they can trip this battle out. So I think uh, we're not going to see too much change on that. We do have a charge, not a charge, not but a movement forward by first VA after MSG went up. 
And with this flag here, they might be able to stand for a good amount of time. I actually really, I approve of this uh, maneuver here by, there's two flags here. This is very dangerous. The Union needs to not just exchange fire. They need to wipe this out if it's going to stay here. But it's going to fall back. Okay, so. Never mind, but if that stayed there, that that is very dangerous for the Union. In fact, you can see 8th Georgia, 19th Indiana. I'm going to try to uh, maneuver and knock them out. If they can knock out these flags, they'll be in a great position. I might have gone this way of night or even tried to send an element around to cut off their retreat. I actually don't know what happened to this charge. This is very weird. You fucking Why are you running, boy? There's two of us here, boy. You're fucking rambling, you no. fucking... So that charge, I thought, had more weight to it, but it seems to kind of just collapsed in on itself. Um, and uh, Ace Georgia kind of got all separated. And because of that, uh, the first VA and its friends over here, the NYB, was able to hold. And over here, we've got a looks like we've got a charge developing as well. Hood is going to try to hold back the 8th Alabama. But you can see how many men they're losing. That charge over there cost them a lot, to be honest with you. That was not a good charge by the Union at all. It was a much better hold by the CSA. This is a problem, too, the way the Union set up. There's, there's too many men all spread out. There's too many skirmishing tickets happening right now. This is a major problem. Oh, you guys, shit. I am running for my life. What the fuck y'all think you're doing? Save the egg slingers, boys. Get off my fucking egg slingers, you bastard. Oh, there's an officer to the right. So now this left side has completely collapsed. You still have some of 42nd over here getting back in, but they have lost a ton of tickets. Now we've got a charge developing over here. Looks like it was a much better charge this time. A. George was able to wipe out one unit here. We'll see if they can swing up. There's another charge by 19th Indiana. We'll see if they can knock out the flag. That is key. But here comes First Sergeant Johnson bringing up some men, and, his, and this is going to probably staunch this attack here. You can see the 8th George is getting a little bit too distracted down here. Got the grass with Mississippi. But now he actually, no, nice reformed his men in a good, no, he, he, he reformed his men well. Um, yeah, no, Knight did a good job reforming his men there. I take that back, what I was about to say. But as you can see, he's not going to be able to outshoot two flags. That's impossible. Is that three flags? Oh, it's two flags. Yeah, the CSA element here could just hang out now and exchange fire with Knight, and that'll work out great for them. In the meantime, they have, you know, HL and MS, you know, all these other units are pushing forward. Yo, what the hell, man? You're Come being here, rude, Come here, you son of a bitch. Wait, wait. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> every time he ship left, ship left. <laughs> What's that? Who Trump was that? Yeah, they have really pushed back this Union team back to its, uh, basically to uh, the cap point here, and they're in a lot of trouble. Just to the right of the fucking... Yeah, they're coming, they're leading. Right to left, boys, got the grab. Not too, didn't look like too many dropped. Uh, now there's a lot of combat power here that's not engaged. The CSA elements here did a good job of stopping them. I can see now, like, you bring out a skirmish unit like uh, AB, try to distract uh, Knight and his boys. I think you'd be in a very good position here. You don't want to have them um, not in this fight here when it happens for points. So if you keep them distracted, that will work very well for the CSA. Just that sigh, that disappointed sigh. <laughs> the fact oh, I hello. don't agree with Joker has his men right now. You have security with uh, the Union over there. There's no need to watch this side. You need to be in this fight over, oh, over here helping out these guys. Oh, shit. I mean, unless you're going to join the attack, which I think Joker's doing. In that case, never mind. But uh, for this to work, they need a lot of combat power. And they need to strike very hard and very quickly. And they're a little bit too separated. Joker's not here with Knight. Oh, NCAPD, hold down! 
So that was a nice attack by 8th Georgia. Was able to swallow up the AB there. Oh my god. We're gonna get sandwiched. Keep running. All right, so the problem is 8th Georgia went down the hill while 19th Indiana struck in here. And they're gonna get swallowed up here by the CSA as they come down. And that's gonna mean a lost flag and that Union cannot afford that. Well, maybe the flag got away actually, but still. Oh, you motherfuckers! Oh, I got you! I got you! You're... Keep running, just keep running, boy. Just keep running, just keep running. You good, you good, you good. Just keep running. It's a lot of friendlies. Watch the fire. That's that's friendly. Fire! Fire! Just get through. Move it! 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 Move so that actually worked out okay. They were able to get a few kills. But again, now we're looking at both teams taking losses. You need almost break half a uh, morale state below. Looks like there was another attack over here. Six New York and against MWB, and it looks like 42nd was involved in this fight as well. Looks like 42nd won the fight. That might allow them to secure some ground. The question is how many flags did they drop? And if the CSA got them out, they're going to get their forces back very quickly. Yeah. The flags are out. Flag is here. That's three. That's four. Uh, CSA will completely respawn here in a moment. There's no point in spawning main anymore. Just spawn flag. And I, I don't know why you're hanging out over here, to be honest with you. Fall back. Fall giving back, them tickets. Fall yeah, fall back. Don't stay there. Let's see how many of these guys get out. There's two. The Serpentini. Oh, don't go that way. Uh, two got killed, two minute out. Is that HL coming up? Yep, here comes Gene. He's going to bring his men up, trying to do an attack. Uh, to be honest with you, 22 minutes. They're in an excellent position right now. Fuck him up, fuck him up. Behind cover, get behind cover, look away. Shoot those stupid bastards down. And find a fire. Right on wave. I'll give you a little kiss on the cheek. Oh shit, wave. Oh, fuck. Uh, with this, this CSA isolated, I would agree with the charge actually right now. If you can wipe out a flag and get a more forward defensive position while they only have so many men forward, I agree with it. Knock them out as fast as you can. Do not let the CSA mass on you. You know, they're all the way back here, you know, engaging a small element over here. Was this 19th Indiana? No, it's actually PB. Good job by PB dragging off a unit. They dragged off the 8th Alabama. Good job by them. Let's go, boys. See, now it's too late. Now they're getting their reinforcements in. So the opportunity to wipe this is gone. It's going to be much harder now. This game is now much more about seizing opportunities. You have very small windows in which you might have superiority in numbers. Pull back, pull back. It disappears Farther. very, pull very back, quickly. And it's not easy in a uh, game mode without uh, with only uh, communication by runners and stuff to actually coordinate those kinds of attacks. And you got to be very intuitive. And, you know, if you see one go, you go into support. Oh, they got to kill Hankel. They need to get Hankel. It's key for many reasons. Not because of the flag, because it's Hankel. Yeah, come get us. Yeah, you stupid fuck. Took you long enough. You, you just stabbed your buddy. You dumb motherfucker. You see, the Union was able to take that out pretty easily. Reload in the burn. Uh, volley from uh, 19th Indiana. Oh, we're getting pushed out. We're getting pushed out. 
But now you got a pretty good attack developing here. You've got 8th Alabama supported by the NYV. I like this attack. Kind of a distracting element. And the NYV is going to sneak up on this side. Oh, they turned a little bit too soon. Okay. Uh, I, who was this up here? Good maneuver up here. It was Joker and Bocephus. They were able to kind of see it. Let's go. Oh, fuck. They're still in the tents. Hi, Bailey. Now they're in a very exposed position, though. It's Somebody time to get out of here. It's time Parents, to go. Stay in formation. Hey, get your ass in a line. They're going to volley us. Get ready. Get ready. Get into the perm. Take care of the volley. Take care of the volley. Uh, I don't know. Now you can oh, fire. Now you can fire. There's a Rambo right there on the right. Union at breaking, just under 19 minutes. CSA a little bit uh, above them. I'd say about maybe a fifth of the wild state. Uh, great position right now for the CSA. It's going to be very tough for the Union to hold this. Over here, I guess we have to go through this. Sprint, sprint, sprint. Come on, boys, get up. And interestingly, Joker's going to move up again. Is he going to try to ambush through the tents? It might not be a bad idea to try to uh, distract them, but he can't lose too many men doing it. It's a great opportunity for who is this for the NYV to ambush him. Pilot, can you tell Mando to break shoulder shift? Uh, face, they're coming up the center. They're coming up the center. Enemies coming up the center. Pull back, guys. Pull back, pull back, pull back. I tried to do a little distraction. I don't know if it was worth it, to be honest with you. Now you see the CSA is all masked up on this side. Uh, with an excellent cover from the wagons and the Artie. You can see a flag out there. You want to stop at the caisson or go over? The rest of you guys, hold your fire. Oh, we got a forward movement. Right. 40 seconds going to try to advance and fire a great volley by the 42nd into the first VA. Hey, fuck you, Stinky. They're in the berm to our rights, by the way. So we got NYV on the other side of the burn. They're going to try to ambush the 42nd. Let's see if it works here. Ooh, Elvin already shot. Union has taken a lot of casualties right now holding this. And the CSA is pressing them pretty hard. I don't know what else the Union could do, though, at this point. Um, I mean, you could take PB off, but that's not a lot on a guard duty. I think you keep that, to be honest with you, just in case. So, CSA is hit breaking. I'm not sure what else the Union can do right now, but try to maintain fire. I don't know if there's a sneaky move. Maybe another attempt by... Uh, yeah, but these guys are watching here, so you can't. Good coverage here by the AB and WS. Now if you just keep, no, now if you just keep a one-for-one one drain here on the uh, Union on this position, you've won the game. You can see that Artie is definitely doing his work. Georgia, I want y'all to fucking left wheel, new line, right here. Left wheel, new line, new line, new line. Left wheel, new line. Direct straight down my line, right there, boys. Dick high, take game, Georgia. Take game, take game, take game, Georgia. Back behind the case on slow. Don't block me just in case I need to run if they come charging. 
Yep, yep. No, I'm body blocked. We got a lot of room on that right hand side. We got a, right, we got a, let, we got a lot of room on that right hand side, y'all. By the bar, by the bar. One, two, one, two. Oh, Ari. Got it. That's what she said was wild. Awesome. So we do have a wide flank maneuver here by the pilot. If he can get behind the Union line, that may really unhinge the defense. We'll see if we can do it. I, I agree with this maneuver right now. The Union is entirely focused. We'll see. Who is this coming out here? The West Virginia. We'll see if Lightburn could stop him. That flag does not need to be there, though. Oh, get that flag back. Oh, do not be here, flag. Oh, it's horrible. Get out of there, flag. Don't get killed. Don't get killed, flag. Get back. So the problem for Pilot now is he's kind of exposed himself and given up that that surprise he might have had. Yeah, we're good. And he might draw some more fire. We'll see. Union continuing to lose tickets at a higher rate than the CSA, indicating it's a one-for-one -one exchange right now. Hey, get low for now. We might be able to See, they're going to try to ambush him and wipe out at least one flag and try to even up the fight a little bit. Let's see if 42nd could do it. It's a good volley. You know, set him back here, but unfortunately the flag is up. Those guys will be back here. How many bodies was that? Let's see. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You better Buddy, 30 seconds, those seven men will be back. Well, it's technically 35 seconds, but, you know. Buddy, I'm doing pretty damn good, though. You tell me Gentlemen, I do And the CSA union is getting very close now to last stand, 13 minutes. Uh, the CSA has basically won this map at this point. It's going to take a pretty significant uh, maneuver here by the union to, to unhinge it. Joker trying to draw some fire and some attention through these tents. Um, I don't, uh, I think that's a good idea. Try to do something. And you got PB out here as a guard uh, in case the Union, the CSA right. we'll gets, uh, right. get there. Triple quick, triple quick, triple quick. gets, uh, antsy Take here. Aim. Here's AB. Steady. See if he can Steady. do some damage there to Fire. Joker. Yep, he can indeed. Fall back. Oh. I thought she was creeping chance too. Right there. Yeah. You can see the Union's just about on last stand now. Every shot I take is a good shot. I've literally gotten six shots. Twelve minutes. Wayne Gretzky said, "You miss one hundred percent of the shots you don't take." Oh, I keep dying. Good shot by Lightburn guy. This guy's getting the flag down. Y'all need more room. You can move up to this case on where Morgan's at. Well, thank you, Perkins. Thank you. Oh, you're right, man. You're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, a, that's, like... that's it. That's it. Keep it up. Uh, keep it up. Okay. Uh, you can see the CSA has got their already up here now as well. Uh, is this a fight out here? Who's fighting out here? Look, fight those legs. Let's sprint. Pilot's still trying to be a nice little nuisance here and distract a lot of the Union fire. Good job here by the NYV. And I think is that a big push by the CSA? This might be the final push here. There's the last stand, and this will be it. Oh my god. No, chicken sandwich. Chicken sandwich. Chicken sandwich. You know, it's unfortunate. Uh, they might have been able to get them down the final push if they had a slightly higher ticket advantage, and then there might have been a small window if they could knock out all the CSA flags. Actually, oh, they're just gonna miss it. There was a there was a there was a small opportunity if they had. 
knocked him down to final push without their flags to fight them out here in a gunfight with their, you know, even though they're on last stand, you know, to try to delay them enough, long enough to hold the point. But uh, unfortunately, you know, they did not have. And here comes MSG who has slipped in behind, and that'll end the map. They did get him to final push, though, which on Boulevard Heights camp is a uh, accomplishment in and of itself. Good job. Watch yourself. Watch yourself. Friendly. The fucking. It's an enemy. Shoot him. Kill him. Right, good job. Friendly. 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 Watch yourself. Watch yourself. Enemies right here in front, boys. Uh, go home, GI. Get him, boys. Go home, GI. Go home, GI. Get that boy. Go home, GI. Ah, wow. Watch the TKs. Home, GI. Watch the TKs. Whoa, whoa, yeah, yeah. Hey, right, right. hey you, you want a popsicle? <laughs> Ow. <laughs> you can see if you if you know, this is, they were slightly ahead, you know, on the ticket balance, they might have been able to delay these guys out here with enough combat power. I don't know if they would have won, but it, it could have been close. I don't think it was unwinnable. That might be a controversial take, but um, I think they were, you know, it wasn't a perfect play by uh, either team. You um, with the star. You know, and it was a good play by the Union, but I think, you know, there were some mistakes as well. Um, kind of getting caught out unnecessarily a few times. And some missed opportunities to knock down the CSA flag and create a, uh, you know, an imbalance. Pick but um, flag, even if it's not ours, it's still pretty damn close. You know, this is um, this was not a bad defense by the Union, and it was a good attack by the CSA as well. So, you know, even though, like I said, there's some, some things that didn't work out quite, it was still a pretty close match. The CSA won, and they never really were behind, but the Union did not make it easy either. And that is it. So that is it for the TSA. Only one map tonight. Uh, unfortunately, like I said, they, they had problems on the other one. But um, good start. Uh, and looking forward to next weekend as we continue through uh, the Harpers Ferry maps. All right. That's all I got until next time. See you all later.